This game just destroyed Roblox's servers. Roblox is removing voice chat from your account, probably. Some crazy new Roblox updates and just so much more in today's video that I want to talk about after I thank my subscribed subscribers, because if you're subscribed, you're really cool. And if you're not subscribed, you're not very cool uh, at all. And uh, you can fix that by subscribing. Obviously, it's pretty obvious. And yeah, we're trying to hit a million. Anyways, let's get to the freaking news, because there's quite a bit of news in today's video that I want to talk about. And you might already know about a lot of it, because it's just massive stuff that happened yesterday. But we'll get to that in a second because we're going to talk about some smaller stories, okay? Such as this new menu that apparently is released. Now, now I personally haven't seen this. Maybe I'm just blind. Roblox released, like, their new pause menu a couple days ago or, like, a, I don't know, like, like a week ago at this point. We already know this, right? But apparently there's something that I just missed, apparently, in this whole update that I want to talk about because, I don't know, maybe I'm stupid. So let me just launch up a game really quickly so I can check this out, all right? So if I hit pause, okay, I don't personally have this. All right, so I'm not blind. I'm just stupid, maybe. Oh, but here, okay, so here's one thing I didn't talk about when, when I talked about the whole new menu. So you can actually like capture a scene for your reports, which is really cool. But on top of the capturing a scene for a, a report, you can actually like have a whole tab, apparently, that'll show you all of your screenshots on Roblox. Here's a screenshot of what it looks like. I don't have this option. I don't know how you get this option on Roblox. Maybe it's the, maybe you have to take a couple I don't know. Let me just take a screenshot here. And, uh, nope, it, it doesn't show up. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't have the, the option. I just have this. I don't have the captures menu. But apparently a lot of people do have this menu. And yeah, that's kind of it. It's not really like a crazy update. It's just something that I didn't notice. And... I finally noticed it recently, and I also don't have it. So I guess maybe in the future, if you don't have this update, you're probably going to be able to check out your screenshots on Roblox through the Roblox pause menu very soon, which I guess is a fine update. It's not really like a big deal. It doesn't change much, but uh, yeah, it's better than nothing, maybe. I don't know. But now we can talk about the next story, which happens to be something that is a bit interesting, to say the least, because a couple videos ago, or maybe a video ago at this point, I talked about how there was a fake rainbow skibbity toilet hair Roblox uh, item where it was basically shaggy Roblox and it was rainbow. You get it. You get the point. It was a 44 million Robux item that was just re-uploaded uh, onto Roblox. Now, as of a couple days ago, it actually got removed and it just turned gray, right? And nobody could buy it. It was on purchasable and it was gray but apparently somehow it got rezzed bro it won the gulag because if you go on roblox you can see it's right here i can go to it i have it i still own it and it's not banned now i'm actually grateful that it's not banned because listen guys <laughs> this hair is is freaking sick but uh you know <laughs> a lot of people are getting mad about it because it's a very expensive limited item obviously people get mad yeah yada yada you get it but me personally <laughs> Hey, hey, man, this is sick. And also, yeah, it went gray and now it's back. Like, it literally got revived. Like, what's going on here? And on top of this now, if you go to the recommended items on this item, there's even more, such as the pastel side swept hair which is a pastel shaggy, which if you don't know, is a very expensive Roblox item as well. Now, again, with these items, I do not care. I do not care at all. I think they're funny. I like them. I literally bought all of them. As you can see here, here's what the pastel rainbow shaggy looks like. This one doesn't really look like it at all, but you know, you get it. And yeah, uh, there's just so many of these fake shaggies popping up. And honestly, I'm a big fan. If I'm gonna be real, guys, I'm a big fan of these. I do like shaggies, so you know, whatever. But the, the main thing, Thing is this one because it died and it came back to life how did it do that i don't know but now we can move on to the next story which happens to be lox fruits apparently allegedly hitting two million players so uh, there was a screenshot floating around twitter and discord basically claiming that blocks fruits the game blocks fruits that we all know if you've never played blocks fruits you are not a roblox player you've never played roblox in your life but as you can see the game now has a dang near a million players but apparently it peaked at around 2.7 million players or something yesterday according to this alleged screenshot now i personally couldn't confirm this the only thing i could confirm is that blocks fruits actually maxed out at around 1.6 million players yesterday which is still a crazy number and i think it's very close to breaking a world record if i'm gonna be be honest but if you're curious and you don't actually play block streets and you don't know why it's happened they basically released like a big update or something it's called update 20 i i don't know i don't play block streets okay but i do know that the update 20 thing is huge so yeah i don't know so yeah you can just kind of tell that this update was giant and yeah they had around 1.6 million players on it at one point like all at once and uh this kind of all goes into our next story because all day yesterday roblox was broken so if we go to the rtc roblox twitter whatever account you already know there is 10 million tweets of them saying roblox is down roblox is down roblox is down and it all started off on the 21st 
As you can see, the more I scroll, there's so many. So on the 21st, RTC says Roblox is back down. Or Roblox is back, not down. It's back. And then you scroll up like 10 minutes later, it's down again. And you scroll up again, it's down. You scroll up again, it's still down. You scroll up again, it's back, but it has a little banner. And you scroll up again, it's down. And this just went on all day. I think it went down around 12 times all day yesterday. And like, there was maybe like around two hours all day where you could play Roblox. And dude, the more I scroll, the more it's just still down. Roblox seems to be operational again, but you may experience some issues. Scroll up an hour later. Roblox is down for the eighth time. So yeah, this was just going on all day yesterday. If you were not on Roblox, you uh, should be happy because you missed a lot. <laughs> you missed a lot of this stuff. And then as you can see, as of 12 hours ago, Roblox was finally stable. It was not going down anymore. So for around like 12 to 16 hours, I think, Roblox was just on and off. Like it was not working at all. And yeah, that's what's going on with all that. And a lot of people are saying it's Bloxfruit's fault because they had so many players. And honestly, I wouldn't be surprised because, you know, back in the day when Pet Simulator used to be, uh, you know, at the t at its peak, whenever they would release an update, it would literally crash the website. And I, I think Pet Simulator had less players at peak than Bloxfruit's, I think. So like... I don't know, man. It's just kind of crazy to think about. So yeah, that's what was going on with Roblox being down like 12 times yesterday. It was pretty funny, to be honest. You can even see there's even more screenshots of the people saying that it reached 3.7 million players, which I don't know how true that is. Because on like the Row Monitor website, which is a website that like tracks how many players uh, stuff has, it says they maxed out at 1.6 million. But granted, the website was down half of the day, so those numbers could also be, like, not very accurate as well. So maybe they did hit, like, 3 million. Maybe they did break a world record or something. And on top of all of this, something else happened when Roblox was down that was a just a very big glitch that uh, might have affected you, and you might not have noticed, okay? So basically, if I go on Twitter and I search up Roblox voice chat, right? Something that happened was, after Roblox started, you know, getting its footing and not crashing as much, everybody started tweeting out that they don't have voice chat anymore. So if you scroll, you can see I had voice chat and spatial chat before Roblox went down. When it went up again, I could not find my voice chat. And this is just the most common thing on all of Roblox right now, is that people don't have voice chat anymore. They used to have voice chat, but then Roblox went down and they lost it. And uh, let me check if I personally have it as well. Let me go to my account that has voice chat and I'm going to check if I actually lost it or not, okay? I know personally my friends that have voice chat have not lost it, but I've seen so many people on Twitter, and I've even seen some developers say that they lost it as well, so it's not like, it's just kind of weird. Okay, so looking at my alt account with voice chat, it seems like I still have it personally, but yeah, if you just scroll through Twitter, you can see everybody saying that they just don't have voice chat. Like, this is a tweet from four hours ago saying, why is Roblox running their servers on a potato? Give us our voice chat back. And if you scroll up, you can see a tweet from Maximum ADHD, who is a very, very popular Roblox developer. He was literally at, like, RDC and stuff. He tweeted out basically saying, if your Roblox voice chat has is still disabled, just re verify your phone number and that'll fix it. So yeah, if you guys are having problems with your voice chat, try that. Now, personally, I don't have a uh, phone number equipped on any of my Roblox accounts because I think it's just stupid and I didn't lose it. So I don't know. I don't know why this all happened, but yeah, you might've lost your voice chat and yeah, nobody knows why. This is going on with Roblox and uh, voice chat and Roblox crashing. And yeah, bye.